you guys let's do the the personal ad stuff. Sheila Wood Friendship Club. Better known as the personal ad. In front the call bag is here. Um Here's the gum I'm chewing tonight, by the way. America's original double bubble. Fruit flavored gum balls. Bubble gum. Sleep. Remember to turn down your contrast and turn down your turn down your brightness. If you even watch the actual video, because if it's too bright for your brain, it's hard to fall asleep when it's too bright. Okay. Mm -hmm. Sheila would. Friendship, friendship Club from the Globe. Are better known as the personal ads. Women Seeking Men. From West Virginia. Pretty old fashioned country girl. Seeks a mature, loving man. A long term relationship. A single white female. In my 40s, brown hair and brown eyes. Five foot three. Affectionate, playful, loyal, lovable, no games, and I have a great personality. <laughs> Next, from South Carolina, we have tall, black, Cherokee, Christian senior woman. I'm a retired hairstylist. Seems rich. I love reading, church, traveling, and I promote gospel concerts. I'm in search of a tall Christian, over age 64, senior, businessman, who doesn't lie. No smokers, no drugs, no alcohol. Sense of humor, military plus. Send me your photo and phone. Canada. WWF. White widowed female. Nice looking. Everyone tells me. I'm a retired legal secretary. A mystic. I have premonitions and I have dreams and I'm Looking for someone who's sober and who doesn't smoke. I'm five foot five, hundred and thirty-five pounds, in search of a pen pal, age sixty-five and over. Next from out of Florida, a Caucasian female, age sixty-five, looking for a gentleman who is financially responsible and stable and you like to travel. Be caring and be in Florida. Send me your photo and your letter with your phone number. And I have a great personality and I'm willing to relocate to where you are. <laughs> Here's another one from Florida. Single white female. Five six, hundred and twenty five pounds. I'm attractive and I'm caring. And I am a non smoker. I am in search of someone age sixty five or older. Gentlemen 
who who is a single white male who, like myself, has many interests. I want a long-term relationship, and I want you to send me your photo and your phone number. I will relocate to you to any country, any continent. No inmates, please. <laughs> and next we have Kentucky. I'm dog dead gorgeous. Personality to match. I'm Italian. Descent. 5'7", 125 pounds. Long hair and alluring brown eyes. Athletic and fun. I'm seeking a financially secure gentleman for friendship, possibly romance. Send me your information. Hmm. Texas. Correctional Institute inmate. Oh. Look what they did. They highlighted it in yellow. See this one in yellow. Does that mean caution? No. I think they just want they will highlight it to get attention for color. But this lady is a correctional institute inmate. She's naughty, she's young, and she's beautiful. And this pussycat needs taming. I'm in search of a long-term relationship with business. I'm oriented, marriage-minded, single man who's white. I'll send you my picture upon request. I want to know if you can make this cat purr. Next, from Washington, Christian lady, slender and sleek and slim. I'm seeking a non-smoker, someone who does not use drugs, a gentleman, age 66 to 78, for marriage, Puget Sound area or the California coastline near Monterey or Carmel, California. Please no desert areas. Write to me and I can come to where you are. No inmates. USA. First time ad. Slim, Filipina nurse. I'm a lady. I'm 59 years old and I'm seeking a gentleman. Age 6 year over. For friendship. I am open to marriage also. Military. And disabled veterans. A plus. No criminals. No inmates, send me your letter and your photo. Next we have from Florida. Golden gal seeking a gentleman, age 65 or older, for friendship and possibly a future. I will relocate to fit your needs. No inmates need apply. Send me your phone number, send me your picture. And send me your intentions. Mm. Mm. Well, that's it for the women. No. Men seeking women. I'm right off at the top. This one's all in red. We have to pay extra for that. New York. Correctional Institute inmate, handsome, financially secure, business technician, genius, <coughs> excuse me, enjoys modeling, traveling, cooking, dancing, jazz, wine, beaches, and the quiet Latin lover life. I'm in search of a similar interest, lady with similar interests. Status, rage, ace, green. Unimportant. I just want to be your friend. 
for a long-term relationship. Next, I'm in North Carolina. Widowed white male. Retired, age 70, healthy, 180 pounds, 5 feet 9 inches. I'm in search of a petite lady. Pen pal for friendship. Long-term relationship. No smokers, no drinkers, no drugs. You be retired and financially secured and be ready to relocate here. I want to dance, enjoy the beach house, enjoy our home. Send me your photo, your phone number. No jailmates, inmates. Next, out of Iowa. I am a 75 year old, 6 foot, 175 pound male, drug free, non smoker, easy going, family oriented, good health, average looks. I'm a retired court officer and part time farmer. But I'm not tired. For entertainment, I like to go to movies, visit friends, and to church. I'm singing, searching, excuse me, I'm seeking for a single white female, age 50 to 80, attractive, honest, loving, drug free, no smoker, social drinker, no health problem. Fun to be with and enjoy life. Please send me your photo and your phone number. You must have your own driver's license and your own vehicle and be financially sound. I am not a babysitter. Oh my goodness. What in the world? <laughs> Next, from Wisconsin, we have big woman is desired here for this big man. Please be 275 pounds. Be a sing As I am a single white male, age 49. The bigger the woman, the better. Race and age is not important. I like dining out and watching football, cuddling, and fulfilling your desires. I'm Madison, Wisconsin area. I will respond to everyone who writes to me. And they're outside of Nevada. I'm looking for a special relationship with a thin, dark-haired woman under the age of 35, living in the Reno area. My number one hobby is watching old movies and old TV shows. I have over 500 of them in my collection. If you write me, mention a few that you know you would like to see. My name is Brad. Let's exchange photos and let's exchange phone numbers. I'll answer your questions. Let's see where this wild ride will <laughs> Let's see where this wild ride will lead us. I'm open to everything. You be too. <laughs> and now we have Virginia. Like Forrest Gump, I know what love is. I'm a handsome black man, an army veteran, age 59. Retired homeowner, seeking a white female, age 50 to 70. Send me your photo and your phone number. Uh -huh, out of Louisiana. Someone writes, I'm soon to be a divorced white male, age 55. I'm handsome. And I'm in search of loving, caring, special needs parent. Age 35 to 55. 
faithful and one who wants to relocate. I'm a proud dad of a happy, artistic child, and I like barbecues, gardening, and families, and family. <coughs> Excuse me. Smoker is okay, but no drugs, please. And next, out of Pennsylvania, a man writes, mature artist, writer, seeks a lady to explore, loves adventures with. Inmates or large size women are welcome also. I'm a healthy, warm, witty, single, open-minded man. I love all kinds. Mayor, photo and phone number. My next out of Louisiana, man writes, I'm age 59, I'm tall, trim, from Louisiana, white male. My heart is for caring. Both ways, I will give and not take. It doesn't matter your age or your weight, doesn't matter. But I do need your picture and your phone number, please write to me. And next, out of next out of uh, again out of Pennsylvania, a man writes, truly lonely, no family, no friends. I'm a single white male, and I'm age fifty-seven, five five, one hundred and forty pounds. I have long hair and a good disability income. I'm looking for friends, especially female friends, who want more, or friends with benefits. I, all responses welcome. Hmm. Well, there you have it. And I have one more section. I have uh, one last section. I was uh, Men Seeking Men says, uh, Kentucky, Correctional Institute inmate, tired of cold, this electronic cold world, miss the personal touch of the handwritten letter, looking for an honest, sincere guy to share life with? Here I am. Send me a photo on your phone number and be willing to relocate. I'm here for you. Yeah. I guess this is the connection section. Out of Arizona, single white male, 50s, 5'11", 169 pounds, working, attractive family type, uncle, BFF, quiet, reserved, affectionate, bisexual, gay, curious, lonely, Desperate, deserving, seeking the same. At any age, age 18 to 50. And we can relocate if necessary. Send me your phone number and your picture. Oh my goodness. Well, there we have it. I call it the personal ads from the globe, but it's really called the Sheila. Wood Friendship Club. Mm, I love reading these. It reminds me of like the personal ad sections from like the back of uh, newspapers and stuff from the 70s and 80s. Uh, I said, find true love through our friendship club, just like these happy couples. Um, they have this couple been married since 1992, Terry and Patricia. Then this couple up here, Jean and Paul, been married since 82. And this lovely couple, Levi and Melody, been married since 93. Because they find true love for our friendship club like these happy couples did. These three happy couples met their true love through the Globe Sheila Wood Friendship Club and you can too, for a chance to live happily ever after with your soulmate. 
see the instructions below in the box how to place an ad. Okay, so let's see how we place an ad. It says, how to place an ad. Place, place an ad by mail. It says, add a cop, add copy and payment by cash to such and such. Sheila was out of Tampa, Florida. And then how to place your ad by fax or email that they give you. Um, the information. Cost of the ad per week. This is like so expensive. Listen to this. To place an ad, the cost per week is $37. So the minimum, even for just a few words, is 37 bucks. Up to 25 words. Then, 59 for 26 to 40 words, $90 for 41 to 55 words, and $113 for 56 to 70 words. And each additional word, over 70 words, is a dollar seventy per word. Can you believe that? Then, if you tint your ad yellow or a yellow tint, I can see this girl up here has a yellow tint. That is nine dollars extra on top of your bill. Or if you want red text, like that kind, that's a nine dollar extra. But then, if you put an eye stopper logo at sixteen dollars, okay, see, here's an eye stopper logo right there. So, this guy paid sixteen dollars for a logo, eye stopper logo, the heart. And nine dollars extra for the red text, and then how, whatever he paid for the word. So it's sixteen plus nine, that's twenty-five dollars. Plus one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I would count thirty-four, fifty, eight, nine, twenty-one, twenty-four, five, six, seven, thirty. You pay thirty-seven dollars on top of that. Thirty-seven and twenty-five. That was not like sixty some bucks for that. Um, all orders. Be sure you include your name and address and phone number. Um, written conversation response number will be sent when the order is processed. And the categories that you can put your ad under are uh, women seeking men, men seeking women, women seeking women, men seeking men, and connections. Those are all the different categories. These are all the ads. Eye stoppers, check mark, lips, put my ring on my finger, look, and hearts, hearts, hugs and kisses, hugs and kisses, and happy, happy face. Huh. Sheila will add or publish. Um, responses to your ads are not guaranteed. And then it says how to answer. Oh, she, by mail, you put the stamp on and then you put the ad number on the back. And you put the response in the, ad, in the envelope. And then you place your response in the envelope. So you're putting like an envelope inside an envelope, I think. Address it to Sheila Wood out of Tampa, Florida. Then it says, uh, 
response costs six dollars each or three for fourteen dollars. So if you have three different responses, you would have three different envelopes and you put a stamp on each envelope and you'd put the number of the ad on the back of each envelope. Then you would stick those three envelopes in a big envelope and you would mail it to Sheila Woods. And then on that envelope that you're mailing it, then you put your return address on that big one. They give you a deal for three ads. It's only $14. They give you Beware of any communication in which you are asked for monetary assistance. Oh, that's good advice. Uh, abbreviation chart sample. ISO is in search of LTR, means long term relationship. TLC, tender loving cat. SBF, single black human. SWF, single white female, SBM, single black male, SWM, single white male, WWF, white widow female, BWM, black widowed male, C means Christian, S means, if you just have these one letter one letter things mean C means Christian, S means single, D means divorce, H means Hispanic. And be sure, child, don't forget about this. This is notice. Any correspondence and or interactions or dealings you engage in with an advertiser or responder is done so at your own risk. Beware of any communication with which you are asked to have monetary assistance. Um, it's terrible. It's kind of spooky. Have any of you guys ever placed like one of these friendship ads? This guy sure paid a pretty penny for his ad. Can't get over it. Let's try. Let me do the math again because I'm not that good at math. Okay. Huh? Um, Sixteen dollars for the logo. Nine dollars for the yellow highlight. That's twenty-five. Actually, he paid $59 because he had 30 words in there. So, 50, 60 plus 25. He paid $84 for that ad. It's like unbelievable. Because that. Oh no, he had the. Oh, he had the red text. It's still $9. So, 16, 9, 84 dollars. That is something. Well,
Thanks for watching.